Hi, everybody. I'm here with Nikki Rob. She's with the Missoula Community Foundation, and she's here to talk about Missoula Gibbs. It's a little different this year, as you may already know. So, Nikki Rob, you want to take it away? Sure. Yeah, we're excited. Missoula Gibbs is this week, this week coming up on April 30th, kicking off at 5 p.m. and going till May 1st at 7 p.m. And in light of the current situation, we have had to make some adjustments to our giving day. You know, fortunately, this giving day is set up to be an online driven fundraiser. So we use an online platform for these nonprofits to do all their fundraising. So that was great. You know, it enabled us to make some adjustments and cancel all of our in-person events and cancel our trainings and do everything virtually. So this year we are going to be live streaming off of the MissoulaGives.org website during the giving day. So that will be both Thursday and Friday. We will take a small break in the middle of the night so everyone can get a little bit of sleep. <laughs> and what but can people expect? We will uh, be back for a live streaming event, which we're really calling a celebration of the Zoom. Nice. And what can people expect from this, um, from watching this live stream? Well, we're definitely going to be celebrating Missoula and touching base with everything that's going on with our nonprofits. You know, this year we have 138 nonprofits participating. Um, and that's everything from animal organizations to youth organizations to some of our frontline organizations, you know, the food bank and the Pavarello. Uh, we've got a whole gamut of groups participating. And so this year we will have um, some promo videos and some highlights from different nonprofits who get to learn about some of the things they're fundraising for and what they're doing for our community these days. And then we'll also have some other really entertaining local things. For example, we're gonna have a, a variety show happening Thursday night. Uh, we're going to have sort of a live tell us something event. We will be broadcasting on Friday, the virtual first Friday event that happens from five to six. Nice. We have a cooking show. We've got some live music performances. We've got a poetry slam. We've got some, uh, you know, a whole block in the middle of the afternoon where we're going to have some really great kids activities. So parents make sure to tune in on Friday afternoon and get your kids entertained for a little while. Nice. Um, yeah, I mean, this is, uh, sounds like it's a very, um, it's limited, but it's also a very um, um, diverse in terms of just like uh, uh, quality, quantity, and all that stuff, um, all the above, basically. Yeah, for sure. For sure. It's going to be a really unique culmination of our community streaming throughout the day. So I'm excited to see people tune in and learn about some of the great nonprofits and highlight some of the things that these guys are doing. And just to, to have a fun celebration today, we've got a couple like energy and activity exercises. We'll do a yoga in the morning on Friday. So yeah, we've got a full jam packed day, not quite 26 hours, but pretty close. So you're talking about what you guys are doing, but um, Missoula Gives is about giving and uh, how can people give uh, through Missoula Gives? Yeah, let's talk about that for a second, because this is an online fundraiser to benefit our local nonprofit community. And due to the current situation, our nonprofits need Missoula Gives more than ever. I know it's a hard time for people and not everyone can afford to give, but if you can give, we encourage anyone to make a donation. The minimum donation is $5 and with 140 nonprofits, you're sure to find some that you have been touched by, that you care about, that you wanna support during these times. So it's really easy to make a donation. All you have to do is go to missoulagives.org. There's a search bar right there. You can find that organization and simply make a donation on their page. Also keep an eye on social media because our nonprofits are pushing their information out and, and showing exactly where you can donate. So if you're on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, keep an eye out for those pages and a lot of them have direct links that will take you to their donate page. Nice. Well, is there anything else you wanted to bring up? Um, is there, um... So what is the deadline? Uh, so this year's event um, takes place until May 1st at 7 p.m. So you have all the way through there till May 1st to make that donation and get in there and, and help these nonprofits out. Um, but you can always support these nonprofits. If you can't do it today, don't hesitate to reach out next week. Um, as I mentioned, a lot of these guys have had to cancel spring events. They've had to cancel classes. They've had to you know, stop operating, which has stopped their income. So. Now more than ever, we need to support our nonprofit community. So once we get through this, they are there to bring us the light that we always count on. Nice. Well, thanks, Nikki. Um, I really appreciate you coming on here as well. Um, and uh, the website where you, people can find more information about Missoula Gives is? MissoulaGives.org.
Awesome. Well, thanks, Nikki. I really appreciate it. Thank you.